Miss McBundy, are you done with me, Oss? Uh, no, ma'am. I had to send out for extra parts to reinforce its feet. <laughs> that and a sign to go round his neck saying, I'm with Fatso. <laughs> You save your tongue for picking the flies off the pools that dance beneath your arms. <laughs> Go to. I'm in a nurry. Oh? Is it the festival of pork pies and pig swallow you're late for? <laughs> While you're waiting, I've got a plump pony out back you can snack on. You have been warned. I am a great and powerful witch. Not as powerful as yon mighty seams in yon dress to keep yon belly off yon floor. <laughs> That's it. I curse thee, Seamus McBundy, and all thy male descendants. Henceforth, ye shall only shew the large and ungrateful. Ooh, yikes! Saveth me! <laughs> And so that ye and all your male descendants will be hated in this place forever, Lower Unton shall always be in darkness, though other towns nearby stand in sun. Oh, will you be floating above us, blocking the sun? <laughs> Just for that, throughout eternity, your feet will sweat. Aye, and verily smell. <laughs> How could yon blubber belly curse me? <laughs> I hurled the unspooning stone in the big game. Had I not married, I would have turned pro. <laughs> and so it begins. <laughs> hmm. Early to be this dark? <laughs> this can't be my life. What am I, cursed? <laughs> All right now. <clears throat> Ladies and gentlemen, we are assembled for our noon meeting. Mayor Fifshaw presiding. <laughs> now, as we all know, Lower Uncton has been in darkness for four centuries and will be so as long as a male Bundy lives. I will now call upon our village historian, Mr. Winston McPhee, to take over the meeting. Winston? I don't have to tell you, it's been a bloody good year for killing Bundys. No. <laughs> We've tracked them down wherever Bundys have spread over the past few centuries. And in fact, they were easy to find because no matter what the country, all we had to do was go to the local shoe store. And there they were. <laughs> <laughs> now, uh, as you know, the curse will only be broken if all Bundys are killed within our town limits. And whilst this monumental task has indeed almost broken us. I am nevertheless very happy to announce that there remains only this Bundy <laughs> and his son as the last male Bundys on Earth. Oh. <laughs> so the curse will be lifted if we can bring them here and force upon them an agonizing death. Yeah. <laughs> now, one question remains. How do we get them here? Look, we've just won a trip to England. England? <laughs> Unbelievable. I know. What's England? 